Do I have a timer? This is my answer. I don't know. Okay. This is my answer. Did Kay. you just put eggs? Two thirds. <laughs> And welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be doing a very different type of video. I've never done a challenge on my channel before, so this is gonna be the very first one, and I brought the smartest people that I know. As you guys saw in the title, I'm gonna be doing a new segment on my channel called Dumb, Dumber, and Dumbest. So basically, we're gonna be answering a series of questions from math, science, and geography, and seeing who can answer the most questions right. Okay? Hey y'all, it's your girl Doris XG, and all I have to say is expect the unexpected. Hi, I'm Doris XG. I'm here to win. I don't have to say anything else. Oh, you're, you're gonna need to come back. Yeah, sorry. There's more questions. Okay. School is a social construct. Who invented it? Why do we have to go to it? School was made by the white man and we need to revolt. Okay. Uh. All I know is that my grades are nothing less than an A. And you will see that today. My greatest skill is being great at a lot of things. I think I'm gonna win. But if I had to choose somebody else, I would probably have to say Ariane Rose. There are a lot of times that she has surprised me in the intelligence domain. My name is Ariane. <laughs> I was a little bit dumb. I was a person that like I would look over to my right during the test and then that girl would cover up her paper. <laughs> <laughs> All I cared about was popularity. Popularity didn't care about me. I would say my greatest skill in school was definitely learning how to hide my fat. <laughs> definitely my worst skill is being smart. I think Courtney is gonna win because she's much smarter than me. My name is Courtney. It's a pleasure to be here. In school, I did what I had to do and I did. I think my worst skill is definitely geography. Geography is not a skill. That's not a skill, but I'm just not good at locating anything on a map. I think I'm gonna win. Yeah, that's about it. Don't <laughs> I think I'm gonna win. If you could gaze into the future, 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 I'm the winner of this game. No, Psych no. And before we get into this video, if you're new to my channel, thank you so much for coming. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being a reason. Wait, wait, can we do that again? I was out of key. I didn't know we were gonna do that. One more time, please. Maybe even if we redo it, you might be out of key again. Okay, we can do it again. <laughs> and if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for being a reason. Don't even ask me. I'm a I'm a Reezy. Last name, remember? Reezy's my last name. Purr. I changed it legally. Purr. Purr. Doris Reezy. Reezy is my middle name. Her middle name. Last name. Huh? <laughs> is this an inside joke? Remember you said you're your middle inside name. of the joke, man. Her middle name is Reezy. Her last name is Reezy. Oh, my middle name is Reezy. <laughs> Are y'all Reezy Rose? <laughs> Why is my stinky on my board? I couldn't tell you. <laughs> So, no, 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 please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so bad. Hey, I rewrote it. I rewrote it. I rewrote it. I rewrote it. And since you're an antagonizer, one time Doris's cousin said that I'm um a what she said? Ring Big body bands. <laughs> with is mathematicas. My math? Ooh. Math is very hard for me. I don't know two plus two. Maybe it's six. Maybe it's eight. This is gonna be a breeze. If there's anyone that beats me at math, I think you would have to actually dislike this video. To be honest. Math is a social construct. Do y'all think you're ready? No, I'm dumb as a fish. <laughs> don't mess. <laughs> The first question is gonna be, ah! how many minutes are in seven and a half hours? Okay, okay. Doris, don't, don't copy me. I got it. Mm. Wait, I'm not done. I'm not done either. Oh, oh wait. Oh, I know it. I'm so stupid. Hold on, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. I actually don't know if this is right. Well, y'all are gonna have to figure it out. <laughs> so, okay, ready? Set. Go. go. What was your answer? 450. 590, 400. Girl, what? <laughs> well, I'll play back to the part where she said if anyone's better than her at math, you dislike the video. If there's anyone that beats me at math, I think you would have to actually dislike this video. To be honest. I guess I have to dislike it now. Sometimes when you're going so fast and you're under pressure, you make mistakes. How do you look at a number and think it's another number? 
So like I said, if, I feel like if I wasn't under pressure and if I wasn't in such a stressful situation, it wouldn't have happened. This is my one tally mark here. Mine is here. Remember it for me, guys. Let me see. Thanks. Okay. Remember it for me, guys. Thanks. What's the next question? My hands are kind of shaking. Sorry, I'm nervous. Oh, what is the value of X? 45 times X equals 30. I literally just started. What can I say? <laughs> Take the talk on the clock. I was like, well, guess. I don't even have a first guess. I have a time this machine. is my answer. I don't know. Okay. This is my answer. Did Kay. you just put X? Girl. Two thirds, baby. Two thirds. <laughs> um. So listen, I felt like that was an easy multiplication question and I delivered. I was very shocked when I saw Doris's answer. I Math is not my strongest subject, okay? But who needs to count when you have someone to do that for you? All my Benjamins, I don't count that. I don't know why I put 60, I'm sorry. I don't know why you did that either. Hey, hey, shush. Oh, Doris, Doris it's okay. Um, let me put my own tally right there. Doris! Who has two? Ariane does. <laughs> I don't need a brag or anything, but I was a math tutor. Math is very hard for me. I don't know two plus two. If you're enjoying this game, maybe you'll enjoy this one too. Thank you, Switchcraft, for sponsoring today's video. I have been so obsessed with this game for the past week. Switchcraft is a mystery game that follows the storyline of modern day witches with a female witch protagonist who is dead set on solving the disappearance of her best friend. Also, a choose your own adventure story, which I really, really love games where I feel like I have options. The story doesn't continue without me. And if y'all have played the game or you plan on playing the game, please let me know who y'all think is a suspect in Lydia's disappearance because I personally think it's Professor Shirazi. Boy. Some stones, Miss Ward, are best left unturned. Boy, I don't know. Let me know down in the comments because he's just a little bit suspicious. How is it that y'all were arguing before her disappearance? Huh? Also, something that I really like is that there are thousands of magical match three levels in Switchcraft. And you basically have to do all those little levels to get coins to continue on with the game. And I think that makes it so interactive and so fun. And literally, I was at the nail shop yesterday. Look at the nails. I was literally playing the game the entire time I was at the nail shop because it was grabbing my attention. They literally had my hands and I was pulling and playing the game. Okay. The story includes 85 plus characters from all different cultural backgrounds, as well as disabled and LGBTQ plus representation. Download and play Switchcraft for free and unlock the magical mystery. I'll leave a link in my description box and make sure to check it out as it really helps my channel if you use the link. And once again, Switchcraft, thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. See ya! What is the perimeter of a circle called? Go. What did y'all get? Circumference. Circumference. Circumference! We all got it right! Yay, guys! Barack Obama! What is an angle called if it's greater than 90 degrees? What kind of question? <laughs> No okay, way. genius. Let's just get to geography. This is such an easy question. Okay, genius. <laughs> You're so obtuse. Obtuse, obtuse, obtuse. Okay. What number does the Roman numeral XXXVIII represent? XXXVIII. First of all, <clears throat> what kind of freaking math question is this? Now you want to start complaining. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I'm just not writing anything. How do you even count this? I've never learned this. I feel like school doesn't focus enough on Roman numerals. School doesn't prepare us for anything. Roman numerals? Ready, set, go. Wait, what did y'all get? I put 38. I feel like I'm- 38! Wow. Checkmate. I genuinely feel like that was a lucky guess. I'm- so I had like, a little fumble, but who has- who doesn't have fumbles these days? You know, you know what- we know the reality of life. Being imperfect is perfect, and guess what? I'm perfect. You know, the Roman numerals, I don't think it should have been in math. You're not doing anything math related. Uh, that question was definitely not math. It was unfair and I deserve a second chance. The same way you have to memorize multiplication, you have to memorize Roman, Roman numerals. numerals. No, you don't because I never learned it, which means it's not. Seems like the school system is a little messed up in your district. So y'all learned Roman numerals? Yes, that was the, yeah, that was the topic. It was presented to us initially in math and then but, it carried on in our future. Yeah. Yeah, you, you no, you can you can just <laughs> God is always on my side. Oh, oh my god. Come on now. <laughs> that was bogus and it was rigged and everybody knows it. CS. I'm actually pretty good at science. You either know it or you don't. And I happen to know it. I really like science because when we're in the science lab, I did make a lot of things explode and it was just really fun. Science can be my best friend, but it can also be my enemy. How many teeth does an average adult have? You literally just went to the dentist. I know, like she literally picked these. <laughs> that doesn't mean I know it. I mean, one, two, three, three, four, five, 
Look at y'all counting your teeth. I don't know what I counted. Exactly. Oh! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of animal do you think we are? I swear I counted 20 on my top row. Well, oh my God. 32. Oh, I'm glad none of us got that right. <laughs> 32? No, we don't. I counted. 32 doesn't seem right. You didn't it count right, babe. And you no. not missing teeth. <laughs> we don't. <laughs> Doris, you're allowed to beat her ass. Stand up. Stand up. Doris, stand up. Doris, stop, please. Fight each other! Oh! Just push her head. I missing teeth too. Next one. I don't have missing teeth. She's just being a bully. She clearly had a number lower than 30. I have missing teeth. I got my wisdom teeth to promote. What are the full forms of AM and PM as used in representing time? You know, I actually know this. I actually know this. Let's start the timer. That is not something I'm supposed to know. How much time left? How a cute morning post morning. <laughs> I don't know if this is right. I know it's oh, Ant Meridian. It has to do with like mm. the Ant Meridian post. Is it? Is it? Do it. Shut up. Basic knowledge. Anybody could say Ant Meridian and post Meridian. You don't have to be smart at all. This actually has five. I'm actually mad. I'm actually confused. <laughs> Wait, what? Am I dumb? No. Do you think I'm dumb? I didn't say I was confused. I said I'm mad. She said she's confused. Because she made me say I'm confused. What? She was pinching me under the table. <laughs> what? Yes, you were. How long does it take for the sun's light to reach Earth? Eight minutes, eight hours, or eight days? I feel like this is a trap. This is. I know. There's an obvious one, and then you're like, damn, am I wrong? Um, I put eight days. Eight oh, hours. Ten, 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 eight minutes. We all got it wrong. Eight minutes. That eight make sense. minutes. That question shouldn't have been included. If you're watching this right now, I know you didn't get it right. And if you did get it right, it was a guess. I'm tired of this science one. I haven't gotten the question right. Me neither. What is the only temperature which is the same in Fahrenheit as well as Celsius? Celsius. That's a big per. The only temperature that's the same. I don't like this either. I literally <laughs> just picked a random number. I thought it was zero, but I thought no, it was it's, easy. it's zero, but I misunderstood the question. I don't want to be the time person. This, this, is, this is confusing me. I feel like zero is too easy. 40 degrees! Answer. I knew it! Zero 40 degrees! How is it 40? How is it 40? Who, who is remembering that 40 something is the same as Celsius and Fahrenheit? Who was thinking of that? I was going to put 45. But you didn't. And then you still would have been wrong. Because I keep saying it. <laughs> How did you even get killed? <laughs> I thought they were saying, what is another degree of temperature besides Celsius and Fahrenheit? Listen, I misheard and I misread. In my book, I'm right. Last one. Oh, you get this right, Lord. What are the three states of matter? Oh, oh my goodness. I just want one that only I can get right. Well, sorry, that's not how the world works, babe. So, wait, we didn't see our answers. Oh. We just all knew we got it right. Liquid, solid, and gas. If you get it wrong, then... Uh. Big purr. Solid, liquid, gas. Simple. Geography. What's geography? We don't actually know how the world looks. So for you to sit here and tell me that Africa is over there and America is over here, for all we know, I could be in Cuba right now. All I care about is north, south, east, and west. And my titties is north. Geography, he, do you hear the patriarchy in that word? Do you hear, do you hear the patriarchy? And my arm is east, wait, west. And this arm is west, no, east. Geography is a social construct. <laughs> True or false? The internet is thousands of miles of cable under the ocean. How is this geography? This Sorry. is not geography. Uh, I feel like this is a trap too. This is <laughs> true. <laughs> that doesn't make sense because I knew it was a trap. There's so many. No, there's so many parts of the ocean that has not been discovered. How are there already cables? <laughs> How are there cables underwater? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all lose again. Which is the tallest mountain in the world? Come <laughs> on, no stuff like this. This is stupid. Ooh, Joyce is confident. Ooh, you're right, I think. I put Appalachian Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't say Courtney is the dumbest. Like she has a lot of knowledge on things that I probably do not know, but it's also things that you probably don't need to know for your life. Do you think I know too much? Your words, not mine. Mount Everest! 
Okay, well, it seems like I may lose. I'm just not good at geography. Like, <laughs> what is the largest island in the world? Okay. Bruh! Oh, wait. I'm not even gonna lie. I may get this one right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, should I spell that right? Did you? I don't know if I spelled that right. All um, right. Oh. No, what did you put? This is what you put. Easter, Easter Island. Island. What is that? It's, it's, the, it's, it's that place with those statues on the head. Greenland. Ha! Wait, wait, no. What was you the didn't question? get it right. So y'all didn't get it What's the largest? Green, Greenland. 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 That's how people say it. These questions are bogus. If you're good at geography, you're bug. Greenland, it's not even green over there. Australia is the answer. I've been told that Australia is a country and a continent. Why is it not an island as well? What planet is nearest to the earth? Isn't there multiple? I think you saw what I was wondering. Was not looking, babe. Um, yeah, I definitely don't know this. To the earth? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, wait, to the earth? Nine seconds. Wait, to the sun or to the earth? Let's put it. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Wait, how do you stop it? I got Mars. Mars. What's the answer? She got oh Venus. Gosh, looking at you. <laughs> I think it's Venus! What? I need to get out. Getting out of bed. <laughs> oh my. What? <laughs> Easy peasy. It's Mars. There's a reason why people want to go there. I've literally never heard anybody talk about Venus except when it comes to tennis. That's it. I don't know why I remember Venus being close to Earth. Bro, I've got eight out of 15. I've gotten four, so. How many countries are in Africa? I actually don't know. Sad. Wait, I'm stuck between two answers. I hope I get this right. And if I don't get it right, I'm so sorry to all the Africans out there. Yeah, I, me too. I'm, I know I'm not gonna get it right. Okay, y'all ready? Got 52, you I got 56. 46. Yeah, I know it's definitely in the 50s. 54! Wow! Yes! Come on! It was 52 or 54. What do you say come on for? Yeah, what are you Because you got it wrong. I think we should do who's the closest. I got 56. I got 52. You still won no matter what though, so it doesn't... <laughs> like, what if she wants? I was very close. I should have got points for that too. <laughs> Yes, I'm African. Yes, I did not know. I basically got it right. I'm so sorry to my Africans. Um, we're still, we're still good. So send hate to Doris. So as you guys can see, there is a winner. Um, Unfortunately. So the number one dumb person here is. <laughs> All right. Okay. So yeah, you're a winner. Um, My okay. default, to be honest. Venus, like, come on, really? Yeah. I don't care if you thought Mars, it wasn't right. I really thought I was going to be the dumbest. She set that. it up. She I have to that. say that she set it up. She said, oh, I'm gonna do the dumb persona so I can win in the end. Exactly, exactly. This is all a setup. Then, that was very dumb. You were not dumb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I can over deliver when I win the game. <laughs> First of all, yes, I did set it up because it's better to over deliver, okay? I won just because I was very humble in the beginning you always have to be humble and you will get some blessings coming your way if you're so conceited about everything you do baby girl you're gonna be embarrassed like some other people were <laughs> um i would like to say thank you to all my high school teachers thank you for preparing me for the world not taxes but the world i feel like most of these or a few of them i got by luck don't say that it's you know she should say that because it's the truth she's like, the winner I embrace hold on we need to have a moment here. No, you. She won fair and square. Mm. Yeah, she won by one point, but she won. And it's time for you to accept that, loser. Mm. <laughs> Ariana Rose! I lost, and I know how to admit that I lost fair and square by one point, but I still lost. I may have only gotten four points in the entire game, but you know, I don't work under pressure. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. If you guys want me to do more of these, please let me know. Congrats to the winner! Oh, Congrats, Ariel. Oh, two, two hands. I mean, it was a very close race. You no, know, in the beginning, I did say Ariane would most likely win. She has a lot up there. A lot of meat, but a lot of knowledge as well. Oh, thank you, Dork. <laughs> She just called you a meathead. <laughs> yeah, but I was saying thank you. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Please make sure to follow them on all their social media. Everything will be in the description box. I'll see you guys on my next one. I love you and peace.